no one should have gone through what you went through in Mexico. Honestly, I I think it's amazing. And you can even get out of bed in the morning. You're so dressed. And instead of coming home and getting time to heal and getting taken care of, you found out that your whole world blew up while you were gone. Right now, you shouldn't have to think about anything but getting over what happened. You shouldn't have to think about anyone but yourself, but you're a mom. You have to think about T. Yeah, he's the most important thing in my life, and he always will be. Right. So you have to do what's best by him. And you, you got to put yourself and your feelings on hold. I need to speak to Teresa about Kate. Well, it's a little early in the day for that, isn't it? Oh, I need the fortification. Dealing with a person that I despise. Awful woman. A harridan who... Oh, it's you. Hmm. I love you too, Vic. But you know what? You can cheer up. Because it's not going to be as bad as you think. Huh. It's like Clytemnestra saying, how about a nice warm bath? Okay, if I stipulate right now that you know a bunch of Greek crap that I don't, can we just, like, move on? Get down to business. I'm here because I need your help. Well, as Socrates once said, forget about it. I know you're not going to lift a finger to help me, but this is not about me, Victor. It's about Brady. He's about to lose custody of Tate, and you're the only one who can stop it. Hey, Brady. Hi. Look, I'm going to get out of here. Please don't go. And then maybe we should go out for coffee or something, because I, I think we need to talk privately. JJ knows everything. I told him everything that's happened in court. That your lawyer accused me of murder? Do you think that's any worse than what Chloe had to say?